Really? Oh! oh, he got clipped there. He got hurt. Coming up next, it's a UFC light heavyweight division encounter. Well, if you choose to stand on a napkin in the center of the octagon and stand and trade with this young man, you're playing with fire. Frightening knockout power. Go look at the highlight reel. As good a reel as anybody in the sport, you can be sure he'll be looking to find a home for those heavy hands early and often. You do not want to get in a slugfest with this young contender, I can assure you of that. This guy has an incredible ability to control fighters. It's extremely frustrating for the man on the bottom, but once he gets the fight to the ground, oftentimes that is where the fight will remain. Well, what a pop from the crowd as this guy makes the walk. Such a well-rounded fighter. And you got to think when the opponent breaks him down on film, not a lot of weaknesses jump out of the video. This is a true mixed martial artist. May not stand out in any one area, but plus skills across the board. Probably comfortable just about anywhere this fight goes tonight. This fighter has an iron jaw. I have seen him take shots on the chin and not be affected. Shots that would knock a lesser man completely unconscious. Our tail of the tape for this light heavyweight tilt. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters with similar height and some differences in reach. We send it inside the octagon, we find Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Saitama Super Arena in Tokyo, Japan. <laughs> This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of 21 wins, 10 losses. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 205 pounds, fighting out of Irvine, California. Ladies and gentlemen, presenting the former UFC light heavyweight champion of the world, who in time, Rob Page Jackson. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the right corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands 5 feet 11 inches tall, weighing in at 205 pounds. Fighting at a current team of Brazil, the Executioner. Right, the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. Want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, go back to your corners, come out fighting. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? You ready? Here go we fight. go. Rampage Jackson is known for his huge slams. He's a solid wrestler, a powerful striker, and he doesn't get a lot of credit for how intelligent a fighter he is. He always comes in with an effective game plan and adapts well to every opponent. And he connects there. Joe, how do you think he approaches this challenge? Quentin Jackson is known for his thunderous punching power, particularly his overhand right. Very nice. Oh! Beautiful body shot there. He's in 
big, big, big trouble. Well, Joe, I know he respects the power coming back, but it looked like he moved right into that kick to the body, and his opponent landed it flush. So let's see if he changes up his footwork a little bit and tries to avoid further damage to the midsection moving forward. Works the double underhooks here. Push it forward now with strikes, and now he's able to secure the takedown. Left hand. Oh, pretty good work here from the bottom, Joe, as he tags him with that punch. Tries to pass, but doesn't make it. Nice reversal here. Oh, tags him again with a flush left hand. In full guard, nice reversal. Really missed with that right hand. Oh! How about that shin? Just over three minutes to go. Tags him with that uppercut. Oh, that's a big block, Joe. He got tagged there. Slips the punch nicely there. He just whips that punch in. Nice leg kick. Big Saw left, left punch. there. Powerful jab. Hard straight punch. And now he lands a combination. Oh! He's got to be careful here. He hurt the game. Oh! Unbelievable. from a different angle. And here we see it again. And he's out. Well, what a moment for this fighter here tonight. A massive knockout on the sport's biggest stage. Seminal moment for that fighter tonight. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliano calls a stop to this contest at three minutes, 13 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, the executioner. So there he is, the man of the moment. Certainly maximized the showcase here tonight, Joey. Gets a big win by way of the knockout. Certainly kept the judges out of it here tonight. Perhaps some bonus money is coming his way, but there will be no wiping the smile off of his face tonight. He will party deep into the night with his friends, his family. A huge knockout turned in by that man here tonight. And he has set himself up for a huge fight now, moving forward in... Oh! Oh! Trying to spin to the back. And now into full guard. to establish that jab once again. Well, big oh. shot to the head. He's gone. Oh, oh he got tagged. Yeah. Oh. He's out. Oh. Beautiful strike here to end the fight early in the first. Yeah, we're just getting going, and now the fight's over. But excellent striking technique to land that shot and ultimately finish the fight here in the first. You've heard us say it before, but sometimes when you catch a guy cold before he's had a chance to get going in the fight, it can have a bigger effect. It certainly did here tonight. Let's see it again. Take a look at this from a different angle. Bam! Lights out. And there he is, all smiles. Body kick, look at that. 
Yeah, yeah these are what did you say about my mother punches. Let's see if he can follow it up. Yeah, looks a little lost here on his feet. of that strike he landed it right on the chin and that spelled the end of the night for his opponent here it is from a different angle great angle here i mean just stiff well what a moment for this fighter here tonight a massive knockout on the sports big